so this is the circuit diagram here uh, this part is the capacitor power supply section uh, a simple uh, capacitor at uh, 400 volt is used and the resistor r1 is 47 ohms 2 watt or you can use 100 ohms 2 watt for this diode i used for uh, 1 and 4007 and the rest of the components are very really common for 12 volt regulation i used uh, is an diode here uh, this generator should be used either 2 watt or, or higher if you have that, have one uh, and for 5 volt regulation 7805 volt regulator is used okay the control section is designed with the uh, lm358 uh, op amp ic uh, inside this uh, op amp we have uh, two different op amps uh, i used one here for uh, control controlling temperature sensing and controlling as I am using only one relay but if you want to use two relays then uh, you can utilize this uh, two opums inside of uh, LM358 here uh, this is the sensor RT1 temperature sensor and this is the uh, preset uh, regulator you can say preset or pollution meter uh, in here the other uh, part of the op amp is used as a buffer as i am not uh, using uh, two control or two relays so i am using this as a buffer you can use two op amps uh, keeping the sensor and sensor in this sensing pin as common for both of the op amps and uh, control two different relays one for cooling and other for uh, heating for better hysteresis uh, gap and uh, better result but uh, you can also you can also use uh, two different circuits for cooling and heating even you can use a single circuit for cooling and heating but if you uh, use a single circuit for both cooling and heating then what will happen either uh, relay is on or off either heater is on or regular is on okay either either load is on so that's uh, that's why a temperature fluctuation will have happen relays uh, for different uh, loads then uh, a wide uh, hysteresis can be obtained so here is the pcb diagram this uh, diagram is pretty simple uh, phase and neutral is uh, entering with in this point and the output is uh, taking out from, i'm taking out the loads from uh, this two pins Power is off pump and other single components as you uh, see in the circuit diagram. Okay, you can uh, use two relays or uh, you can design with two relays utilizing that uh, part of the off pump. So let's see uh, the test result. So this is the circuit uh, in a practical. I used uh, this common sensor, what I use for uh, other, in other, other products very common temperature sensor uh, you can find it uh, in uh, inverters or other industrial control systems other part is uh, the capacitor relay and uh, other components so here is the circuit mm, let's power it up now you see as temperature is below the set point the heater is on uh, if I uh, touch this sensor or uh, bring this sensor to the lamp, temperature is a uh, little warm here. Uh, still, uh, the heater is on. Let's uh, touch the sensor. Yes, uh, the cooling system is uh, turned on. If I uh, uh, release the sensor, the sensor is uh, sensing low temperature of the set point, then the heater is on. This process uh, will be uh, repeated. So if you use only one circuit, then uh, the will be system will be repeated. Okay. Don't forget to subscribe this channel. Also, don't forget to visit the blog. Uh, more interesting things are coming in future. Thank you.